here to talk about the state of the retail investor as well as rates and more is Thomas Petterfee. He is the founder and chairman of Interactive Brokers. Mr. Petterfee, welcome back to Squawk Box. I, I have to say that's a pretty unbelievable number. I would, I would almost have thought that people were running for the hills, not running to sign up. Uh, they are not running, but I tell you, tell you why they are signing up. It is because we pay very high interest on idle cash. So uh, people who have idle cash with us uh, we, in, in their brokerage account, we pay them 3.83% uh, interest. And that's more than they would get anywhere else. So that's why we get all these. Oh, I customers. got you. Okay. So the hunt for yield <laughs> is, uh, is helping you out. I, I, I hear you on that. I mean, how would you... Right. What do you think the state of mind right now of the retail investor is based on the kind of flows that you look at, the kind of trades you see, et cetera? Well, people, people have lightened up on their stock positions or they have hedged them. So uh, the, the retail investor is not really bullish. Uh, they, uh, you know, they are more likely to trade options, vertical spreads. Uh, there are people, you know, option options trading is really uh, going gangbusters. It's 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 a very very active market, so uh, that's what's happening mm -hmm. now. Uh, all this, of course, is is going to be very complicated by the SEC proposal for the new trading rules, because uh, I I just spent a long time going through these proposals. And uh, uh, if, if, if they were to pass as written, uh, that would be excellent for interactive brokers. But I think it would be horrible for the marketplace because it would hollow out markets. There would be no, there would no, would be no bid offers uh, visible that would be tight. So they would be very wide and uh, they would be easily uh, manipulated and so the mid price where the SEC would like all the trades take place would keep jumping up and down. So that's uh it's it's not going to work as written. You you're you're alluding to the fact that the SEC wants to require brokers to auction customer orders. I, I believe that's what you're talking about. I mean do do you think that that's actually going to take place? No, it's not that they want to auction them off. They want to force them to trade at the mid price or very close to the mid price. So in between the midpoint between the bid and offer. And uh, so if, if, if that happens, then uh, there will be no incentive for people to put in bids and offers as they conventionally have. So the mid price will become meaningless, a meaningless price. It will be very, so if I wanna buy a stock and I know that I will buy it on the mid price because uh, you know that's where the SEC wants buyers or sellers to meet. I, if I put in a bid, that will raise the mid price and it will make my stock buy more expensive. So I will not put in a bid. I will put in an offer to to lower my price, even though I wanting to buy. So this is this is not that hasn't been thought through well.